Are you looking into getting your second home now for your retirement that's gonna happen in the next couple years? If so, here's my top three things for you. Number one, if you are gonna be going back and forth frequently to visit kids and grandkids or family, uh, make sure you're within an hour of a major airport. That's gonna make your life much easier in the long run. Number two, are you planning to rent this house out while you, over the next couple years, while you wait to move full time? If so, make sure you check the rental market. Have an expert, experienced realtor in that area help you determine what the rental comps can be. You have the ability to cover the cost of that house completely for you in many markets if that is what you're gonna do. But you need to make sure that you're in an area that it has a strong rental market for the house you're gonna be buying. Number three, have you checked the climate all year long and make sure that it's something that you like and is gonna suit what you're looking for. As an example, my parents had bought in North Carolina, um, but that didn't quite suit their needs. It was still a little too cool. And they ended up needing to resell and buy in Florida. Conversely, some people come to Florida thinking it's ideal. However, sometimes they decide that the summers are just too darn hot. And now the Carolinas was actually perfect for them. So make sure that you're looking at that whole picture. So one, make sure you're within an hour of an airport if you're going to be traveling a lot. Two, make sure that you've checked the rental comps if you intend to rent that property. And three, make sure that you know what the climate is like in the area that you're going to move to completely. Sample it out. Take a trip, you know, at different times of the year. Make sure you like it.